come on in, two sisters tell, gather round everyone. I have here my trusty magic gate box. Let's take a look inside, see what it has to show us today. Take what resonates and leave out the rest. If you don't resonate with the reading, feel free to check out my other videos. You may have some messages there. Now without further ado, let's start the reading. I hope that you had a good weekend and your week's going good so far. And all is well for you. Garbage pill kids, and let me go pick that up. Oh. Let's do fly. Then we have three of wands in reverse. Knight of Coins. Page of Swords. And the Six of Wands. Bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Cups. Okay, we're going to start with the Three of Wands in reverse. And I'm picking up that you no longer have to wonder when your ships are going to start coming in because they're really starting to about to arrive now. When I say about, I mean they're well on their way. So you've been feeling as though that it never will happen in the way that it should. You might have got some momentum and then it would come to a standstill or come to a keep moving and then stopping but there was a reason for it and you are and i'm picking up you already know and already to a certain degree why that was and i'm also picking up that anybody especially when you had this page of swords here anybody that might have thought that as far as whoever decided was your enemy per se thought that they had the upper hand i'm picking up they might have thought you they were keeping things held back but that was an illusion especially with the seven of cups over here for the main for the what was at the bottom of the deck that was an illusion to the enemy you already knew what the real reason of a hold back that was happening but it was not for the reason that the enemy that's been watching you thought. And you already knew what was really going on. And that you weren't letting it bother you. And you even possibly picked up on picking up on this that you picked up intuitively. They might have even been laughing, thinking they had the upper hand. But you're going to have the last laugh in this situation because... And you were laughing at a, even during that time 
because you already knew the truth. That is an illusion that they were buying into. That whatever they were trying to do to stop things from happening, from your ships from coming in, was actually an illusion set up to make them believe their own illusions they try to set out to make you feel or look like you weren't going to succeed and that your ships weren't going to come in and that they really bought into their own illusion that they were actually holding it back when it had nothing absolutely nothing to do with them it was being held back for a reason for a practical reason that they are not aware of but you are then we have the Knight of Coin, Knight of Coins. Yes, indeed, it is the slowest knight in the deck. But this is only because this is showing that it's taking its little, uh, just a little bit of time before the ship starts really coming in. But it's coming, especially when you have the Six of Wands here. And then you have people um, picking up watchful eyes, whether they're acting on as a monitoring, a monitoring spirit or just a person that's just keeping an eye on if something is working and trying to hold it in place when in reality that's an illusion especially when you again we have the six of wands here you're going to have your victory and the public recognition so to speak whether you're in the public's eye or not you're gonna have that moment that's meant for you because you're meant to be victorious. And that this is just an illusion that was casted to the enemy that thought that they were really had the hold on something when the joke's really on them because there really was no hold up. And these clouds right here, I'm, I'm seeing this as, as being broken away because at just the right moment is when they're going to look like this right here. Your enemies here. Whoever decided to cross an enemy line or is a monitoring spirit of some sort. Or a spy, so to speak. Trying to see if what they've been doing is working. Like, I'm picking up possibly spell work of some sort. But this look on their face is what I'm getting when they find out whoa it was an illusion that they ever held anything back because I'm picking up like when let's say if a, a, I'm picking up a vision of a dam it holds the water right well if something happens to it it can start having cracks and if the cracks aren't being dealt with and there's leaks happening that dam's gonna just break loose and water's just going to crash through it, right? Well, this is what I'm picking up. This is a metaphor, obviously. This is how your blessings is being held. And it, some of it's been just coming out a little bit slowly, like how this money here is falling out of this bag here. You have little blessings just trickling through it, through the cracks. And at the right pinnacle moment, that that dam's going to burst and pfft, like that. <laughs> I was, I'm, I'm, I'm a very, I'm, I'm a visual person as far as expressing myself. So, just I'm sure you've learned that enough. You've watched me, but oh well. Anyway, it's just it's going to bust free all of it once, especially when you have it this in reverse. So there will be no more waiting on your ships. They're going to just. Going to just like some of the uh, readings that I've done in the recent past, where it's going to slowly come in and then all at once, and there might be a slow up that it happens, but then it's all going to just come through, bursting through. I'm also picking up like uh, being at a casino and you just all of a sudden hit the jackpot, and the money just. Phew, you know, just coins. Well, that's of course that's not how they have it now. But at one time, I know my age is showing here a little bit, but oh well. At one time, you had coins that actually busted out of the thing instead of little ticket. But anyway, coins are just it's just all going to just come out at once. So I'm picking up 
that you're just going to hit the jackpot all of it once. So it was just trickling with this knight of coins at first. Then poof, the dam's just going to burst. Now I'm going to see what I'm getting overall before I move on to the oracle. I'm also picking up bees, these bees right here. It might be flies, but I picked up bee for a reason. I'm picking up that you're going to be a busy bee because you're going to really be going at it. So whatever project or business or uh, even, uh, endeavor that you were working, have been working on diligently, you're going to be like a busy bee because things are really going to start really start going in your favor and just really going at a spot it's going to go from quickly almost just as quickly as it was from the knight of coins to the knight of swords is what i'm picking up i mean that swiftly it's not even going to go towards any other of the knights it's just going to go from night to day type of thing so things are really going to start picking up and I'm also picking up, you're going to have a little bit of a shock to you as well. But yours is in a good way. Because all of a sudden, everything just starts really working in your favor. And it's going to feel like you're going to be in a daze. Like, it's going to feel surreal to you. Because it's just going to be just like, wow, it's really happening is what I'm picking up. And you're really going to feel victorious. And really feel like... Wow, my hard work really has paid off, and it's not in vain. It really has. And all the hard work and your endurance is really going to pay off. And you persevering through any challenges of, or upheavals you've had. And even dealing with possibly people coming at you, so to speak, or spying on you, trying to keep you down because they don't want you to succeed. I'm even picking up people who are more, who should, you would think because they're more successful than you, that they wouldn't even bother to bat an eye at you. But for people like that to come at you like that, it's because they see your potential, even if you weren't able to see it at the time. I'm also picking up, I picked this up plenty other times, diamond in the rough. They could see there was something about you and that's why they wanted to keep you down. Because they knew it when you started rising up like the six of wands, you could have the chance of surpassing even them. And they and I, I'm picking up envy. So jealousy is in the in the mix. So they did not want you to outshine them, is what I'm picking up. So they were trying their best to keep you down so that way you would not outshine them and outdo them. Even though that's a that's a bad way to look at things. There's plenty of opportunities available for everybody to not be that way that's a nasty way of being i mean i'm this is coming from my opinion on this part obviously not from the reading this is just me speaking that is a sorry place to come from i mean that that just says a lot about them not you so just you keep your integrity about things that's on them you just keep doing you and just keep staying in your own lane and minding your own business don't worry about what how they're being that's on you on them not you so that being said i'm also picking milk and honey uh up on this so things are really going to really be a sweet moment for you and you're gonna have a sweet victory and let's see let make sure i'm not getting anything else before i move on to the oracle I'm, feel, I'm feeling drawn to look more at this card here. I'm picking up that your enemies are going to get bamboozled while you get the victory that you deserve and get the opportunities you deserve. Whether they were holding it back or snatching it up in some way because they didn't want you to outdo them. Again, I'm picking up, you might have been dealing with someone who might have been more successful than you and, you're, and you were possibly confused even in this, like, why would somebody who's doing better than me even bother to care about what I'm doing or how well I'm going to do? Again, what I picked up on is because they did, they could see your potential and did not want you to outshine or do them. And they didn't want you to surpass them. So, and I'm picking up, it's not someone you necessarily know personally. It could be, it could be in your little circle of people you know, but it might be just, you might be aware of these people 
or some or person, whichever it resonates. I'm picking up, it could be up to anywhere from one to seven people. So, and also I'm picking up with this card. There is, and there, more times than not, that's how that works anyway. There was a, there's a main person and then there's seven little minions type things, as you would put it, that was working underneath them. So there might've been a main person that might've had these certain people to be their watchful eye, kind of like the, uh, the Wicked Witch in Wizard of Oz when she sent out her flying monkeys. Even though she got them to take, pick them up and take them, I'm picking up more of spy energy than, you know, I audited the movie went where they just literally picked them up to take them to her, so to speak. But in this situation, she sent out her flying monkeys, she or he, it doesn't have to be she. There's a reason why I must have said she. So, it might be a female. There's always a reason why you say something when you're doing a reading. So there's, it doesn't have to be. It could be also because whoever's watching this might be resonating with a, a, a woman as well. So take it however it resonates. So it could be good just because whoever's resonating with this reading is a she, but it could also be a combination of both. It could be your she and it's other females involved. I'm also picking up with this here. It still could be at least one male involved in the situation too. And you might even be aware who that could be. I'm picking up it could be somebody within your family with that, with this male here. And you already knew that uh, that person couldn't be trusted anyway. Uh, I'm picking up it might not even be your blood kin. It might be an in-law, for instance. So only through marriage that you're kin to them. So let me see what else I'm, if there's anything else before I move on to the Oracle. Okay, I, I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the Oracle because that's all I'm feeling like. At the, unless I see something else after I get the Oracle, I'll, I'll mention it. But I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the uh, soulmate, uh, manifestation soulmate. I can't remember what that's called. <laughs> anyway, soulmate, manifestation, manifesting soulmate oracle or something like that. I stopped even leaving my box out. Oh, well. <laughs> so, you're going to have your victory that you deserve. And that's too many cards. even being drawn to the back side of this I mean I'm picking up somebody has been keeping an eye on you close like really really close and I'm picking up you are you probably already aware of it you just haven't spoken on it and that you're not really bothered by it you're just like let them watch let them watch you succeed too is what I'm picking up and that no matter what they try to do, God's still going to bless you. Because they can't keep what God has for you. Follow your des heart's desire and manifest the heck out of your life. So, again, your, your manifestations are going to come into fruition. Because not only do you work on manifestation as far as in the metaphysical, you also put in the physical actions to make it happen too. Because you know that there's actions that has to be taken, not just the, the manifestation part or visualizing or any of that. You know there has to still be action taken, planning and t action taking. And that being right underneath the three of wands here in reverse, that just clarifies more. Your ships are really going to start coming in. So your what you've been working on diligently is really going to manifest into your reality. And I'm also picking up with this too. There's going to be many opportunities coming your way now. As after that, that damn bus 
open, you're going to have many opportunities come your way and you're going to be in complete shock. And then we have this in reverse. Start reclaiming who you truly are in reverse. Um, I'm getting since that's in reverse, you already reclaimed who you are. You already know who you are. It might have took you a, a, some time to come to see who you are, but you, you know exactly who you are and you're standing in your authentic truth and your intent and and then and the I can even get this to come out now. My tongue just wants to get tied. You're your authentic self. We'll just put it that way. <laughs> Sometimes my tongue just gets tied. Peace comes from within. Do not seek it without. And that being underneath the page of swords, again, I'm picking up, you're at peace. Because you already know where the peace really comes from. And you're not bothered by who's watching you, who's trying to do what, who's trying to stop you. Because you know you know it's not going to work because you have your, tr I'm picking up, you have your trust, faith, and belief in God. And you know that your spiritual team has your back. And you already know to look inward for the peace that you seek, that it's not outward. And you're not going to worry yourself over this situation because there's nothing to worry about. They, it was an illusion that they thought that you would be, is what I'm picking up, but you're not. that if you hear that obviously I don't know if you can hear that running water back in there or not according to Greek mythology according to Greek mythology humans were originally created with four arms four legs and a head with two faces fearing their power Zeus split them into two separate beings condemning them to spend their lives in search for their other halves anyway that being right underneath there, I'm also picking up that you will not only be victoriously moving forward when it comes to your career sector, but you're going to come into physical contact with whoever you're meant to be with. So even if someone was holding that back too, that was an illusion for them that that was ever going to happen. What is truly meant to come together will come together no matter what they try to do. Especially what I'm picking up with Zeus split them them into two separate beings. So I'm picking up, there might've been somebody trying to keep you and your counterpart apart too. But what is meant to truly be together will be together, no matter what, you can't stop that. No more than your opportunities being stopped. It might been slowed down, but it, it's not due to them. It's due to it wasn't the right time or whatever it is that you know is already the real reason. And I'm intuitively being picked up picking up i know what it is as the reader here but i'm being guided not to speak on what was the real hold up because i know when to keep my mouth shut about things so i'm gonna see what i'm getting overall before i move on i mean before i close it out and excuse that again if you're i don't know what it's picking up what in the in the kitchen the noises so I'm just going to let you know that. No, I'm, let me see what I'm getting overall before I close it out. I'm here. I'm picking up. Uh, I, I heard horse's butt. <laughs> so somebody has been trying to be a horse's butt. Is it so a butt about something? So again, what I was picking up here. So they, they have someone in, that you might be aware of or not has been trying to be a pain in your butt anyway there was an interruption again okay <sighs> i'm gonna look and see what i'm getting overall bef once again before i close out i'm gonna make sure there's not anything else that i'm getting and hopefully i can tune back in after that I'm picking up your crops are really going to start busting out and with growth 
especially with that six of wands here, but I'm also picking up because all this wheat. Let's see if there's anything else. I'm also going to, uh, picking up, you're going to be blooming. So you're going to like really just start opening up and becoming more of who you are. And really shine forth that diamond within you. And I'm picking up, you're going to really be putting yourself out there more. And showing the world who you truly are. Because you're meant to shine bright like a diamond. That's all I'm getting from the reading. I'm, I'm feeling like I'm not tapped in as much as I was because of the distraction that just happened. I'm also picking. I'm, I'm picking up something from that though. There might be distractions trying to keep you from still succeeding, but it's not going to work because you're still going to push through and keep going anyway, despite that. So it might still try to take you off track, but it won't work. It might take. It might distract you a little bit. But then it'll put you, you'll, you'll straighten yourself out and keep due course and you'll succeed. So just be aware of that. I'm picking up something intuitively from that. It, things happen for a reason. So I'm, I'm picking up from what that happening. That's what I'm picking up from it. So that's all I'm getting from the reading. I hope this brought you some clarity and helped you in some way. And be sure to turn on the notification bell so you know each time I upload a new video. And like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, God bless.